Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will show you exactly how to solve the problem of we weren't able to process your payment methods, pay the amount due to run ads again, or a failed payment on Facebook ads. You try to run an advert, you have an outstanding debt, you want to pay, and it says that the payment failed. Or you may see something like what I'm seeing here. It says that we weren't able to process your payment. Try selecting or adding another payment method. Now, <clears throat> there are two basic reasons why this may happen. Number one, you don't have enough money. The money on your debit card is not enough to pay for how much you owe. The second reason why this may happen is that your card has not been activated for online transactions. These are the two basic reasons. So let's go with the first option. If you are trying and it's not going, and most of you, maybe your debit card currency is different from the currency on your other account. So for example, my Facebook ad account currency is in US dollars, okay? And then my bank account currency is in, let's say, Ghana cities, or Indian rupees, or South African rand, or Canadian dollars, or um, euros. So the exchange rate that you are thinking, your bank exchange rate may be higher than that. So for example, let's say that the exchange rate in Ghana cities is 10 cities to a dollar. And I am owing $6. I will be thinking that I have to have 60 cities in my debit card. But in actual fact, the banks are charging higher than that. So the banks may be charging more than the rate you know. So the money you have may be less than the actual amount you're supposed to pay. So in that case, uh, if you want to know whether it is money problem or not, you have to try paying a smaller amount. If you try paying a smaller amount and it goes, then you will know that it is money problem. Then you pay, you'll be able to know how much they are charging per dollar and you can top up and then pay the rest. So let's top up. Let, let's try paying this one, $1 and see. We actually try to make a payment and it failed. So I'm going to try paying $1. Let's see whether it will go or not. You see, the $1 has been paid successfully. So what it means is that this particular um the payment failed actually not because of anything it's because there was no enough money so now that one dollar has successfully been paid what i just have to do is to go and i check how much has been deducted and multiply that by the amount that is left and make sure i have up to that amount so that when that amount is in my account i can now pay sometimes too it could be that even you may have your what you are paying may be in the same currency as what is on your facebook other account. I mean, the currency may be the same, but maybe your bank has a threshold that must remain in your account. So in that case, you have to make sure that the money is far more than what you owe. The second reason why your payment may fail is that your, your card may not be activated for online transactions. There are some cards, before you can use them, you have to activate them for online transactions. So in that case, if your card is not activated, you just contact your bank, let them activate it for you then you'll be able to use it. If you follow these procedures and it doesn't go, the last option, which is a bonus that will add you is that if you are paying, please, they will ask you to confirm. In the confirmation page, always remove the decimal point. So for example, this is 5.38. Remove the 0.38, pay only $5. Uh, always pay to the nearest whole number and leave the decimal point and it will always go with you. Once again, thank you for watching. If you follow the procedure and you didn't get a solution, leave your comment in the comment section. You can follow the WhatsApp link or Telegram link in the description to WhatsApp us and we help you. Once again, um, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.